Yo, what's up, everyone? My name is Frank. Welcome back to YouTube channel. Today, we're gonna be reacting to Black Ops 6 Zombies gameplay Intel drop. Oh, I'm so excited, man! I think Black Ops 6 Zombies, Zombies in general for Black for the next COD is what's got me excited for. That's why I want to buy his next COD is for Zombies because I'm I've been watching it like the um, I haven't been watching this right here. I, I know people have been doing like they did like the 30 minute video of it and all that. I was thinking about reacting to it, but I was like, nah. I'm not, I'm not going to spoil myself too much. I'm just going to watch these Intel drops that Call of Duty makes and all that stuff. But yeah, like I said in the Fortnite trailer that was re re that we reacted to, anything gaming-wise I post on Call of Duty or all that stuff, again, it's going to go in a gaming channel. Campaign, gaming channel. Multiplayer, gaming channel. Uh, zombies, gaming channel. Customs, gaming channel. All that is going to go in the gaming channel. Again, I'm only using this main... This is going to be my reacting channel, listening to music and stuff like that. Well, that was like a, kind of a spoiler. What I do plan on doing, whenever I plan on getting, a, I plan on getting a webcam, and a uh, so a, whenever a album comes out for an artist I like, we can react to it, listen to it together, see how it goes, and I can upload that as well. But yeah, so let's get into this gameplay intro drop. Been yapping for about a minute and a half, so. It feels like there's nothing else on the market that can scratch the itch that Black Ops 6 Zombies gives. It's... That there. When you... Not... Bro. Literally, the market has been... I think for me, I've been waiting for a good Zombies game. Uh, has there even been a good Zombies game? Since, like... Let's say Black Ops 4 Zombies? I think... I think I heard Vanguard had Zombies. I think it was, that, that was horrible. Cold Cold War had zombies too, and that was alright, but I don't know. Man. It's just so fun to play through that gameplay loop over and over again. Oh, I'm so excited, man. I'm so excited, so excited, so excited. One of the newest things we have is called Augments, and it's the new way for us to upgrade perks, ammo mods, and field upgrades. Oh! We'll give you three major Augments and three minor Augments. Whoa, 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 We gotta go back, go back, go back. Okay, so we have... Three, three major augments. Okay, so let's so equip you can equip them. Uh, select a minor augment to energy mine. A major augment to energy mine. Okay, here's your inventory. Uh, three energy mines will float around you, detonating once an enemy is within the base trigger radius. Okay, the energy mine will split into three mines that scatter and detonate one time each. Instead of detonating. Energy mine becomes a turret shooting targets one at a time. I like this. I like this one. <laughs> I like the spire. Augments. Pretty to choose from. All right, now here's our miner. Increase mech charges by one. Okay, that's pretty cool. Increase detonation count or duration of energy mine. Energy mine now attacks nearby zombies for five seconds. Uh, if I'm gonna do the turret, I might do. One of these, the frequency boost or the high capacity. All right, just keep going. So a major augment could would be more drastic. So there's a major augment that will turn into three orbs that will essentially carousel around you and protect you. A minor cool. augment might be stat changes like this. Napalm burst will now deal slightly more damage. One of our brand like new perks, this. Melee Macchiato, gives you a devastating punch melee. It has a major augment that will improve the melee attack speed for all of your melee weapons. Oh, that's I cool. know perks have been in every game, but the augments really do give a new breadth to perks and using them. What is this? Is this a new perk? Okay, what kind of perk is this? this is a in new every perk. game, but the augments really do give a new breadth to perks and using them. Adding that customizability to using perks, making it feel individual to the one who's using it. So no perk really feels the same. PhD flopper. Are game Ooh, so excited for PhD, you man. So much control over the way you want to play and experience the game. Now we have replaced the armor upgrades in the arsenal with ammo mods. So when you go to the arsenal, you can apply an ammo mod to your weapon and upgrade its rarity. We are bringing Balwagos back and really just looked at how we could refine it and improve it for Black Ops 6. So you okay, so the thing about uh, the ammo thing, I'm fine with this. Basically, I guess it's like the freeze, turn zombies on your side. Make them blow up and shock lightning through all the zombies and all that stuff. Like, basic stuff right here. But, I like this. Ar I guess they're taking armor. I guess armor was... I forgot what... What Call of Duty zombies had armor? I don't remember. But, also, the thing I want to talk about is gobble gums. 
they said they're like changing. I hope they fixed it. I don't know. I don't know how to say about fixing it because I think the system was all right, but it was just the gobble gums in general. There was a bunch of gobble gums on there that was useless in my personal opinion back in Black Ops Three. So I hope they just have a bunch of new gobble gums and they change the system up. I don't know, man. Cause it's random. It's random how you get these gobble gums when you're when you're buying them. So I'm curious what they did to make them better. Cause it, again, like I said, everyone in the zombies community legit does not want gobble gums back. So I am curious what made them bring gobble gums back and how they're going to change it so people in the community will like them again. How we could refine it and improve it for Black Ops Six. So yeah, we'll be able to pick five gobble gums okay. from the menus and put those into a pack that you then use inside the match. And in the match, okay. you just find a gumball machine, you go up to it, and then it'll give you one of those gobble gums. And you can choose when you want to activate them, Ooh. and you can activate multiple at once. Okay, there we go. I like that. You can activate multiple gobble gums at once. Again, you just choose you choose your five in the menu, and that's how you get them in the game. But again. I think the fact that is that you can they can range from small i think the fact is that you can use multiple at once which is pretty really good in my opinion and also they don't pop right away i also like that changes in gameplay to drastic changes and upgrades that can really benefit a player they can give you all the perks at once or okay, even allow you to fire a weapon without using up any ammunition they can be really powerful when it's used in time of manner that is good. Weapon builds are great. They allow players to save a build, which includes attachments and blueprints on a weapon. Do you players with them? to then set that as a zombie build. That means when you're huh? playing a match and you access a weapon via a wall buy or a oh. mystery box, you'll get that zombie build in the game. Gets at its core. I like that. I, what I do hope is that you spawn in with just a pistol. Because I remember, I think. Cold War started it where you don't spawn in. You spawn in with your regular loadout. Let me spawn in with just a pistol, man. Just give me a pistol to spawn in with. I hope, I hope to bring that back. Blueprints on a weapon. Play but I do like this. How you can have your own zombie. Then you can have, set up a zombie loadout for when you're playing zombies. And whenever you get that gun, you get your attachments on there. That's pretty cool. I think, I think what they should have done. Once you pack a punch your gun, then you get the attachments. I think that sounds a little better in my head. But Set that as a zombie build. That means when you're playing a match and you access a weapon via a wall buy or the mystery box, you'll get that zombie build in the game. Whoa, whoa. Gets There's a map. Oh, it tells you where the gobble gum is too. That's cool. So you have your armor here. Your loadout. I don't know what this is. There's like different currencies right here. Okay. You know, I guess your armor is 150 it's HP. At its core, a mode that we love, and we just want to continue to push it in new directions to keep it fresh and exciting, but at the same time, making sure it's delivering on all the big elements that are core to the DNA of the mode. So we're creating new experiences within that. August 28th. Uh, I'm going to be reacting to that. <laughs> Call of Duty next. But yeah, uh, that was his Call of Duty with Black Ops 6 zombies gameplay and still drop hope you guys enjoyed this reaction let me know down below how excited y'all are for some black Ops 6 zombies and again guys i do have a gaming channel it'll be in a link in the description down below top link go subscribe to the gaming channel i will be posting gameplay stuff there soon after i finish my tekken 7 stuff my stuff yeah i just actually plan on doing that now i'm going to edit these videos reactions schedule them for the upload then go re record some Tekken 7 gameplay. I'm trying to finish the game, the story mode today. Then we'll get ready for something else. So yeah. Besides that, we'll see you guys on the next one. Drop a like, subscribe to you, subscribe to both YouTube channels, this one and the gaming one. And peace.